Hi, welcome to Sidewalks Entertainment. I'm your host, Lori Rosales. So today's guests are three successful women who are sent to a beautiful resort in the Dominican Republic to meet 24 young, attractive men to see if they have a connection with them. Uh, these guests are joining us from the Hulu series, Back in the Groove. Brooke, Sparkle, and Steph from Back in the Groove are joining us right here on Sidewalks Entertainment, and they're going to tell us all about this fantastic show. From the Hulu series hosted by Tay Diggs, Back in the Groove, I'd like to welcome Sparkle, Steph, and Brooke to Sidewalks Entertainment. Hi, thank you so much Hi. for joining us. Hi. Hi. So, Back in the Groove takes place at a beautiful resort in the Dominican Republic. And at this resort, there are 24 young, attractive men for the three of you to meet and get to know to see if you have a connection with any of them. Uh, Sparkle, how did you become a part of Back in the Group? Well, uh, the show reached out and because they knew I'd been working 20 years in my business. Um, also, I have a 21 year old son. I got married right out of high school and I had a baby two years after that. And then a few years after that, I started my business. I didn't take a lot of time for myself to be young, to have fun, to get any groove. So really, I don't know that I'm getting my groove back. It might be my first groove. <laughs> I think this is my first groove. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Steph, is that how it happened with you too? Did they reach out to you or was this something that you came across on your own? No, actually, I was performing. I was on stage doing sound check uh, for the South Florida Food and Wine Festival. And I got a, a message on Instagram from a recruiter that um, basically said that he thought that I would be perfect for this show. Um, and then the rest was history. It was like, it just happened really fast because they, they kind of found me like right at the end, oh, wow. um, right before you know they were going to fly us out to the Dominican Republic. So everything happened really fast, but they found me. And how about you, Brooke? Did someone reach out to you as well? Yeah, it's, it's so funny because a friend of mine saw um, the casting company or casting agency post, um, you know, set, put a post up for, on their Instagram back in January of this year. She immediately sent it to me and said, oh my gosh, please do the show. You have to submit yourself. And I was like, oh, wow, this is great. And the concept is amazing. I would fit right in. Um, but I was like, oh, oh, you know, I'm not going to submit myself. And then within a month, like about a month later in February, the casting um, agency reached out to me. Two of, two of the casting agents reached out to me on Instagram. And I've been in this, in the casting, uh, you know, process since, um, since February. So this whole year has been about back in the groove. <laughs> oh, Wow. So Sparkle, does everyone act different when the cameras aren't rolling? You know, in the, in the beginning, initially, I think people have to kind of warm up to the fact that there's a camera in your face for every scene, you know? Yeah. <laughs> there are cameras all around you. And um, I'm, I think because it's so much filming and so many cameras, you quickly adjust. Like, you quickly adjust. I mean, it... it, it ends up being basically part of the room, part of the background, you forget they're there. So, so Steph, was that the genuinely the first time that the three of you had seen these 24 men? Um, or we'll call them, we'll call them contestants. <laughs> was that genuinely the first time that you saw all of the contestants or uh, prior to filming, were you, were you guys able to choose or give input as to who you wanted to be in the show? 
No, I mean, they had asked us like, what was our type, you know, like when they were doing the whole casting process and just trying to find out a little bit about us. <laughs> and uh, we didn't know anything until when Tay announced that there were 24 guys, that was literally the first time that we even knew that there were 24 guys. Like we didn't know how many guys wow. there were. We didn't know what was going on. Like everything was kind of like a surprise to us. So when Tay said it, like, that's why my face, like I almost, my jaw dropped. Cause I was like 24 of them for three of us. And then when <laughs> we saw them for the first time, that was like the very first time that we had ever laid eyes on any of them. We had no clue what anybody looked like or anything. Oh, wow. It was crazy. <laughs> so one last question before we run out of time. Uh, Brooke, apart from getting to know the men, I'm sure the three of you have developed a, a bond as well. What has it been like going through this experience together? Uh, it's been the most amazing, special experience of my life. I can get a little emotional about it. Um, you know, we formed a sisterhood that um, I probably will never have again in my life. You know, um, we were three women that came to the island in similar situations and circumstances in our life. We were dealing with a loss. We were dealing with, you know, grieving of our old life of um, grieving. I, I lost a pregnancy in 2020. Um, you know, Steph was grieving her old body and going through, you know, just kind of like the trauma of loss. And we came together and form this support system and the sisterhood that is I'm so so grateful for and we held each other's hands through it all through every you know little little kiss through every um, romantic date through every you know you know kind of drama that happened on the island we were there for each other every step of the way and I am so grateful. I, you know, this was a, a trip of a lifetime and I'm so thankful for it. Beautiful. Well, wow. You have, you have me a little bit emotional now as well. <laughs> That's so beautiful. Well, the three of you are just fantastic. Sadly, we are out of time, but thank you so much for taking time to speak with me today. That was Steph, Sparkle and Brooke from the series Back in the Groove, now streaming on Hulu. Ladies, you guys take care. Thank Thanks. you. So Thank you. For more full length celebrity interviews, visit us at sidewalkstv.com, our YouTube channel, and don't forget to follow us on social media.